Hello and welcome to Float Brothers. We are excited for your upcoming gravity suspended float experience. But before we do so, let's go over some important information to better enhance your float. We ask that you kindly shut off all electronic devices as not to interrupt yours or anyone else's experience. We also ask you to be aware of your volume when moving around the lobby or hallway. When entering a room, no need to look for a light switch as they detect motion and will operate accordingly. Amenities such as a shower, towels, and storage spaces are provided to help the prevention of highly concentrated salt from getting on your belongings. The organizer on the top shelving unit are several amenities to make your experience more comfortable. Here at Float Brothers, our top priority is cleanliness. Our filtration system cleans 35 gallons of water per minute, guaranteeing a sanitary environment. Showering prior to entering the pod is required. In the event you have an abrasion on your person, after showering, we highly suggest a light coat of petroleum jelly over the area to prevent irritation from the salt. Each pod is equipped with underwater speakers for music in an intercom system, allowing for an adaptable, safe, and comfortable experience. If you intend on listening to your own music, please inform your attendant and place your cell phone in airplane mode. Also, don't forget to disable any alarms you may have. Please make sure volume is low enough to be barely heard from outside the pod as sound moves well through the water once it rests. You are now ready to step into the pod. There are safety rails if needed. Keep in mind this is a wet environment so please be careful. Take some time to familiarize yourself with the pod and where things are located. The water is 10 inches deep and totals 150 gallons with 1,000 pounds of Epsom salt. It is heated to approximately 93.5 degrees Fahrenheit to mimic the surface temperature of your skin. If you get salt water in your eyes, there is a spray bottle with fresh water and a washcloth to wipe your face. We have also provided a bottle of drinking water. It is recommended to rehydrate after your float. If needed, there are earplugs for your convenience. To use properly, roll each earplug between your fingers, then place in each ear. The plugs will then expand, protecting water from entering. Once you are comfortably floating, you should experience the feeling of weightlessness and or very little touch sensation. On the side wall, you will notice a control panel. The gray panel is an intercom. If you have any questions or concerns, simply press the button once to alert the front desk and wait for a response. Remember, there is no need to hold the button while speaking. Next to the intercom, you will find a white button that controls the LED light. Simply press it once to turn on and then again to turn off. If you press repeatedly, it will cycle through different colors. The final button controls the pod audio. Both the lobby music and your private music can be turned on and off with this button. When you are ready to begin floating, you have a few options on the lid placement. One, you can simply reach up and pull down on the handle of the pod lid to close the pod completely. Two, you can insert the foam headrest to crack the pod open. And three, simply keep the pod completely open. You can open the pod door at any point with just a small amount of pressure. When doing so, please hold on to the handle to prevent the lid from opening too quickly. Remember, you are in the complete control of the room. Keep in mind that leaving the pod lid open can result in feeling chilled. If you are claustrophobic, please speak with our attendant so we can make sure that you will be comfortable during your float. As you begin to lay flat, you will notice that your body floats to the top of the water with zero effort. Position your body with your head towards the LED light. This is the most convenient for reaching the controls while floating. You will initially want to experiment with which position provides the most comfort for you. Some people enjoy their arms to the side while others prefer them at shoulder height or even above their head. You may notice after a while that you start to feel pressure build up in your neck. Normally this is because we try to keep our heads above water. This water will completely support you, so by tilting your head back until the water line comes up to your forehead and focusing on relaxing your neck muscles, you can oftentimes eliminate the pressure. If none of these adjustments in the body position work for you, there is also a blue neck support that can be used to alleviate the pressure. It may take a little time, but most people will find a comfortable position using one or more of these suggestions. Once your session is over, the filtration pump will turn on along with the LED light, letting you know it is time to get out of the pod. You will want to take a thorough shower to remove all the salt water from your body. 
However, please keep in mind there are probably others waiting to use the room, so try to be as efficient on time as possible. There is a waste bin in the room for any trash you need to throw away. You can also leave all towels in the room and we will clean up once you have exited. Before leaving, feel free to read any or contribute to our wall of inspiration. We also have tea, coffee, and additional water available for you. We thank you for visiting Float Brothers and hope you enjoy your float experience. Your journey begins now.